we're gonna do a quick walkthrough. This is a new foreclosure that I just received. It's had the trash out, but um, just got it. I haven't been in it yet. Don't know anything about it. Good neighborhood though. Brick home. The roof looks newer. It's got ridge vents, which is a good sign. Doesn't look all that bad from the outside. I don't see much wood rot at all. I see a little bit of chipping paint, but that's not bad. Looks like they had a bush or something here somebody removed. The drip metal looks newer, so that roof could be a nice bonus. Nice little front porch patio area. Holy smokes. Another original. I've had a few of these lately. With the kitchen on the front of the house. Oh, this tile is horrible. Okay, well the carpets and the tile have to go. There were smokers in this house and it stinks. There's the master. Oh God. It's a good size room. Hopefully those windows are not ruined. This carpet's just nasty and it stinks. But good size master bedroom, split floor plan, that's nice. Whoa. Jeez. It's a huge bathroom, but man, is it out of the Brady Bunch era. Wallpaper, this horrific eight inch tile. Big double vanity though. Yeah, this is gonna be a great property for an investor. For the most part, depends on which, what you really want to do with the kitchen. But the cabinets seem to be in pretty good shape. It might could be painted, or you could just redo the whole thing. These floors are horrible. The bedrooms are pretty clean. They just need carpet and paint. New ceiling fan. It's got newer windows, which isn't a nice bonus. It's a guest bath. It's got the same horrendous tile. Big vanity though. This bathroom's not in bad shape. Let's look at the AC. That's older, but you can't tell anything about it without having it turned on. All right, let's walk around back and check it out. There's a little spot in the sheetrock. I mean, it seems like it might, might have pretty good bones. Let's check out the back.